Hi everyone, this is Anastasia from Strapi and in this video I will show you how to add and manage media in Strapi. Strapi supports various formats of images, videos, documents and audio files. All files are stored in the media library. You can add media to the media library directly or upload them when you create a new entry. For example, let's add a new restaurant. Here we can add an image. Let's click on this field and click on add more assets. Now we have two different options, either upload a file directly from a computer or from an URL. We can also download files in bulk. Once the file is chosen, we can have a preview. If it's not the right file, we can delete it or we can edit some of the details in here and see information about the size, date, dimensions, extensions, etc. Let's upload this file to the media library. And once it is uploaded, we can have more functions to do with it. So we click on finish and we see that it appears in our entry. But if we want to modify it, we can do that. So let's click on edit. And here we have a bit more options. So we can delete the file from this entry. We can download this image on our computer. We can copy the link to the image. We can crop it. And we can crop the original asset, or if we want to keep the original asset, we can duplicate and crop the asset. We can also change the file name, alternative text, caption, and location in the media library. It is also possible to replace the media. It's a very useful feature that allows you to replace one image and it will be updated everywhere. Let's say if you are updating your logo or if you noticed a typo on one of the images, you can use this feature upload a different image and then it will be updated everywhere else. So there is no need to go and look for every image that should be updated. For example, we replaced one image with a different one and it will be updated everywhere now. And if we go to the media library right now, we can see that in the media library, the previous image has been replaced as well. All of the files are stored in the media library menu. If you need to find the right asset, it can be quite easy with different Strapis feature. For example, you can use the search, you can use filter to filter by the date when it was created, updated, the type of the media, and sort the assets by most recent uploads, oldest uploads, alphabetical order, and you can use folders to organize your files as you see fit. Now you can create nested folders. For example, I have an illustrations folder here and I can add a new one and name it dessert illustration. Now I can add all the relevant files in this folder. There we go. The media library folders allow you to better organize assets as you see fit and easily find what you're looking for. Thank you for watching this video. By the way, you can use the Strapi user guide to find the detailed instructions on how to use the product. I hope it was useful.